Akshay and I have many things in common. For example, both of us have been doing our jobs for over three decades. Uh, one of us is a martial artist. <laughs> and one of us has 80 million followers. Hello, everyone. <laughs> Uh, unbelievable. And I especially told you not to call me this okay. word. I especially told you. I know he did. He did. He did. But I think there was one superstar I ladies, know who was my father-in-law, Mr. Rajesh Khanna. He 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 absolutely insisted I do not say that. He is so humble. But can we all agree? He's a superstar. So so you and I we started our careers around the same time. Yeah, we started. Now you've from achieved you've achieved a level of artistry that that um, I'm still trying to you're, <laughs> so the two of us I started I started when I was 29 years old Nvidia I don't mean you and I have something in common we both started from Thailand Thailand that's right Thailand we both there. grew up in Thailand in Bangkok and we were just speaking Thai <laughs> he he went to Thailand he went to Thailand to learn how to be a martial artist I went to Thailand just to grow up but <laughs> Well, I had no other choice. I mean, so that was one place which was cheap enough to, for me to go there. And uh, my parents couldn't afford it, so that was the place I went there. I wanted to learn. And it so happened that, uh, that today martial art has helped me where I am. I call myself a stuntman first and an actor later. So, so tell, t tell me, uh, both of us, we've been doing really the same job for about 30 years. All right. And, and constantly... It's the constantly, same job? Literally <laughs> exactly the same job. Okay. Uh, and, and constantly striving uh, to, to uh, heighten, elevate our artistry, elevate our craft, uh, constantly uh, striving to be better. And so, so when you look back on your career, what are some of the things that, that you would say are, are really fundamental to you being here today and really helped you? achieve what you've achieved what has been there to uh, what I have achieved in life and what are the fundamental things that you want yeah to how, what are the what are your characteristics what do you think some of the core values or um, you know your nature that has my led I think to the one of the biggest thing has been self-discipline mm -hmm. that's always been there which has helped me throughout I, it's been like 34 years now in this industry this industry has given me a lot and it's um, one thing is important for me is self-discipline, which, uh, which has got me where I am today. So that's the main part, which it is. And, mm -hmm. and I always believe and I always say to people that, uh, guys, make your children get into martial art. Discipline them up. It is the, one of the best thing and a very, very, very important thing. Your children are also in That's martial right. Art. Both of my children are second degree black belts. Here we go. Yeah. That's perfect. It's the most important thing. That, that's, that's what it has been. There. It, gives, it, gives them, uh, it gives them something to be good at, yep. something they could be proud of. Uh, when you're good at anything, when you're good at anything, uh, it gives you confidence to do everything else. And of course, martial arts, uh, it teaches you discipline. But the other thing that, that you have an abundance of is humility. You're just incredibly humble. And uh, martial arts also teaches you that. It, it teaches you. It teaches you a lot of that. It teaches you, gives you a good confidence. And um, it, uh, I, will, I would like to know something from you. Mm. Uh, you're, probably wondering, you're probably wondering how I stay so disciplined. I'm just saying. You are. Have you noticed? Have you noticed? We're both martial artists. You are. You, yeah. you have done a great job <laughs> yourself. You're 61. That's what, that's, that's what the record shows. Then what is it? That is what the AI shows. That's what the record shows. <laughs> okay. I'm, I, I think I'm crawling up on 62, but I, yeah. Okay, so the, I think you have maintained your... You're four, what, 42? Uh, no. 37. <laughs> okay. And the two of us have been doing the job for 30 years each. That's true. <laughs> he started when he was seven. I started when I was 29. 
Well, you know, uh, uh, my uh, Hindi film industry has never made a film on AI. And uh, like we have a robo bani thi. Wo Hindi picture nahi thi, lekin. All, all I know is Akshay, Akshay says, you, you, Jensen, you have to watch my last movie. It's about super cops. I know it's going to release now. Yeah, uh, yeah. It's going to release yeah, yeah. now. It's, uh, I can't tell you about it. It's a secret. He told me about it. It's about super cops. Okay. Well, yeah, I, I, must say, I must admit that you keep the secret very well. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, what I want to know is, what is one thing which um, AI can't copy from humans? Which uh, I would like to know that, uh, what, what kind of a thing would it, it be that um, humans can do but AI can't? Yeah. And, yep. yeah. Actually, it's an excellent question. And in fact, this is, this is probably the single most vital question for now. Right. Which is, what are, what are all the things that AI can do? What can it do? It turns out that as we speak, AI has no possibility of doing all of what we do. However, depending on the jobs that we do, sometimes it could do 20% of our jobs, 20% of our work, a thousand times better. For some people, it might be able to do 50% of their job, a thousand times better. But in no job can they do all of it. And so this is the, this is the great observation. Because of that, every one of us should apply AI mm -hmm. to automate, to become an assistant to help us with that either 20%, 40%, or 50%. People ask me, you know, Jensen, is AI going to take your job? And I tell them, absolutely not. The person who uses AI to automate that 20% or 50% is going to take your job. Okay. And so the, th that's, that's right. Good. That's right. And so the most important thing, the most important thing for us right now is to build amazing AIs, build safe AIs. Th that's good engineering discipline, good engineering business, uh, good engineering process, methodologies, technologies, all come together so that we can build safe AIs. It's like building a safe airplane. Mm -hmm. The automation systems with diversity and redundancy, all of the backup systems make, makes it possible for air travel, the airplane to be safe and air travel to be safe the same ideas will apply to artificial intelligence. Yeah. I think that, that um, long term, I'm really hoping that all of us have our own AI, you know, co-pilots and AI partners that are with us all the time, remembering things, helping That'd be us. a safe, safe world? That would be a wonderful world. Like, that would like, be a wonderful no, world. No, it won't be like something like what they show in Hollywood films, no. that AI is taking over humans. No, because along the way, amazing engineers like the, all the people in this audience, right. you know, you're, you're talking to basically yes. engineers, a whole bunch of computer scientists. Right. It is our fundamental mission to enable AI to be realized for the benefits of society, but doing in a way that is systematically safe. And not only do we make the AI safe, we create other AIs to keep it safe. We create other AIs to watch each other, make sure that, that it's used properly. Of course, there will always be people who will try to use this technology in nefarious ways. But it is up to all of us to advance the technology so that we have access to this incredible capability to keep society safe. So there can be people who can use it in the wrong side also? Sure, like all things. They can. Yeah, but the good news is there are more people who are good than there are people who are not good. Mm -hmm. And we have to have access to the technology so that we can keep the rest keep of the, an eye on keep that. the world safe completely yep. <laughs> there are one okay. more last question i just want to ask you how many hours do you sleep last night i arrived at three o'clock i was up at i guess six thirty, and so that was only today three for three and a half hours but i'm a hundred percent you know this is it hundred percent hundred percent on it yeah yeah this is fine so do you do kind of some kind of yoga or something no or is it because on the, on the weekend, I catch up on the other 100%. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. 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 Thank you, sir. Thank Akshay. You. Akshay Thank Kumar. You. Thank you. Unbelievable. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.